Hi there boys and girls. What we're going to do today in this video is learn how to make a wet mount slide. A wet mount slide is just another way to prepare a specimen for viewing under the microscope. So what we have here today is this. We have a glass slide, this rectangular piece. We have our cover slip, which is this plastic square that you should have at your station. You have a dropper bottle with an eyedropper filled with water. And then we have our lodia, which is the freshwater plant that we're going to be taking a look at. So the first thing that you need to do in prepping a wet mount slide is making sure that your glass slide is clean. You're going to take some water in your dropper bottle, in your eyedropper rather, and then place about two to three drops. Now I'm going to put an extra one because these leaves can sometimes be thick, so that a little extra water never hurts. Once I have my water drops on my slide and a nice neat bead in the center, notice how it's not off to the left or the right, it's in the center of the slide, I'm going to go in and I'm going to pick out a leaf from my Elodia plant. All right, so I have a leaf here, and all I'm going to do is just carefully and gently place it down on the slide in the water itself. Okay, so this is where I want my Elodia leaf to be. And then the tricky part is putting on the cover slip. Now, when you do the cover slip, the first thing you should do is stand it straight up. So this way you have one edge of the cover slip on the slide. So as you can see, I have that happening right now. Then you want to slowly lower the slip and then rest it actually on a pencil or a pen. Sharp pen, a sharp pencil works the best usually. And you're going to slowly lower the sl cover slip down onto the slide. And as you can probably see, the water is starting to spread out underneath the cover slip. Okay, once you get down to the slide, you can then pull your pencil back. And then that should help lower the slide, but since I said before these leaves can be a little thick, you can tell that the leaf is actually holding it up. So what you want to do next is just gently with your pencil push down on the cover slip so you don't break it or crack it. And slowly do that so the air has a chance to escape out, of, out from underneath the cover slip. And that's how you do a wet mount slide. Okay, we always want to make sure we don't have any air bubbles or very few air bubbles underneath the cover slip because sometimes kids get confused with the air bubbles and thinking that they see something, but they're just looking at pockets of air. All right, boys and girls, that's how you do your wet mount slide. You'll need to know this for your photosynthesis lab. Thank you.